Do you want the mic <laughs> to start? <laughs> <laughs> I uh, could have moved. Nope, I got it. <laughs> Today, Junior. Go over here. Uh, Hey, pro tips for Paras. We've got day 28 coming at you of 30 day yoga movement stretching journey that Sierra and myself, Tanal, have been on. Both T6 level complete paraplegics. Sierra usually leads the way with her movement specializations and kinesiology background. And she will take us away for day 28 where we are back on the ground. Props. Bring yourself, bring a maybe pillow, because we like pillows on the floor. <laughs> so Tal and I watched something today about movement improv, and it got me thinking about how we make up a lot of this stuff. I mean, it's not made up. We have somewhat of a plan. But I invite you, if things don't work for you, find a different way to move. Um, we give like alterations, but Use your imagination. It might not work for you. So if you can't get creative, let us know. Because <laughs> we'll get creative for you. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> All about creativity up here. All right, so I invite you to close your eyes wherever you are. You can do this sitting or lying down. We're going to do some belly breathing. So you're going to have one hand on your chest, one hand on your belly. Otherwise, you can have your hands on your knees. Um, and I normally just do this to think about getting the belly to start moving and not the chest. So if we're going to inhale here, inhale, making sure that the belly is moving out, filling that belly, hold, and then exhale, bringing that belly back in towards you. Inhale, making sure that chest isn't rising. Hold, exhale, bringing that belly in. Inhale. Hold here and then exhale. I encourage you to do a couple more here while we sit. Thinking about sitting up nice and tall, lengthening that spine if we're sitting. Maybe noticing where some of that tension is. Breathing through that tension. And really trying to get that breath all the way up through the spine. And exhaling down into your tailbone. Feeling the weight into the ground. And we'll do one more breath here. Exhale. Um, from here, we're gonna do some saucers. So sitting up nice and tall, and we're gonna draw saucers with our nose. So. Remembering to sit tall, but also relax those shoulders and start drawing some saucers. They can be nice and small in the front. And if you're like me, who hasn't really moved the neck today, you might start feeling it out and getting bigger. It helps here to do inhales on the up, exhale on the down. And then we're gonna switch directions of those saucers. So whatever way you're going, go the opposite way. Doing one more wherever you are. And then return to center, looking up. Tuck 
taking a chin in and looking down. Then from here, we're gonna roll through the spine, going down as low as we can go. Trying to get some curve all the way down if we can. You might wanna push on the ground or on your knees, whatever feels good. Inhaling through and up through the spine. Exhale down to the tailbone. Big inhale. And exhale, coming back up. Sitting up nice and tall. I feel that. <laughs> Looking up to the ceiling. Now we're gonna start placing our hands, if we can, behind us. Getting in that opposite C curve in our back. If we can't go back, sitting here is fine too. Shoulders away from the ears. Big press here. Exhale. Return to center. Let me stretch out where my hardware's at. Mm, what do you mean where your hardware's at? Like, I don't know, like more of <laughs> Yeah. I was going to go laterally. Sure. Do you want to go lateral? Yeah. So. I got a backup glass over here. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was going to modify so I didn't hit you, but that works too. <laughs> so we'll go right first. So you can have either a hand on your knee, on the ground, whatever it is. Taking a hand up and overhead if you can. Otherwise, just staying here and getting some length in the spine. But if you can, we're going up and over feeling that stretch along the left side armpits up to the ceiling making sure we're not dropping down if we can getting as much length as we can all the way up through the left big inhale here So we exhale, coming down nice and slow and switching sides. So left hand plants wherever you need. <laughs> Make sure you're balanced. And then right arm is going up overhead, armpit up to the ceiling. If you can't, we're just here trying to get some length in the side. Yeah. Trying to make pelvis sure the pelvis is up on the ground. Is up on the ground. Is staying on the ground. Oh yeah. Big inhale. Okay, let's do a little bit of a spinal twist. So taking our left hand and just touching our right shoulder, looking over our right shoulder. And exhale, switching sides, right arm to left shoulder, looking over the left. Switching sides. Remembering to breathe. Exhale. One more on the left. And 
And exhale. Okay, I was gonna say, let's go to our backs and do protraction and retraction. Do you want a pillow for that? Yes, please. <laughs> Yeah, so we're going to our backs. <laughs> Chow's gonna have a pillow behind her, which is totally fine. And our hands are gonna go up to the ceiling above us, and we're gonna imagine someone's pulling our wrists up to the ceiling as far as we can go, lengthening those fingers, trying to get as much length as we can all the way up. And then exhale, driving those shoulder blades into the ground. This might be intense, so that's why Tanel has a pillow. Otherwise, it's just slight movement into the ground. Inhale, up to the ceiling. Exhale, down into the ground. Notice there's not much movement here. Up to the ceiling. Exhale to the ground. And then from here, right arm is going to go up overhead. Left hand down towards our toes. Oh, getting some cracks there. Trying to get our hands as far as we can, as close to the ground as we can. If you're lifted on a pillow, that might not be the case. <laughs> Exhale, coming back to center and then switching directions. Left hand going above, right hand going to your feet. Inhale. Exhale, coming to center. Switching directions one more time. Feeling that stretch in the shoulder blades. Exhale, coming to center. And one more time, left going above, right going towards your toes. Really feeling that stretch here. And exhale. Okie dokie, everybody, since we are in the prone position, we will do our last minute of breathing and gratitude and intention after I say thank you to everybody for watching day number 28. 28, baby! <laughs> 28! Whoop, whoop, whoop. So close. So... <laughs> Thank you for watching day 28 of the 30 out of our movement journey. Hit that thumbs up, subscribe, the little bell, and you can continue to watch this show for the next two days for sure. Thanks again. And we will all lie here for the next minute and just focus on the rhythm of your own breath. Feeling your body sink into the floor. And your muscles are relaxed. Just appreciate the silence.